ladies yo check this out today i'm gonna i'm gonna show you something i'm gonna show you some crazy shit all right it's kind of it's kind of crazy you're like man when you look when you see it you'll be like what the fuck do i do that man you expect me to do that no i'm not if you're a beginner i'm not expecting you to do this right i'm just showing you something that you could progress to something that you could aspire to because eventually what you want to do is you want to keep pushing yourself you don't want to get stuck doing things that are easy right beginner type exercises because in what's happening is you're not progressing and you're not going to get you're not going to grow and you're not going to get stronger that's a common thing that i see with people is they get used to and comfortable with certain exercises and they don't want to push themselves because they're like oh well i don't want to get hurt or i don't want to i don't know what to do right all you gotta do is learn baby pick up a book youtube right there's a lot of internet sources there's plenty of fit people out there who want to teach you all right you could hire a trainer you could hire me all right so here's the thing i'm gonna do these tornadoes right so i'm gonna swing this joker round and round and then i'm gonna get on the ground and i'm gonna i'm gonna spike it from side to side all right it's kind of difficult stuff you need to have a lot of core stability but you know before i get that man i'm just ranting so you know don't mind me i'm just talking but you ever wondered why the hell you do things like for example why the hell would you take a heavy ass ball like this and spin it around right why would you do that have you ever thought about why why you're doing certain exercises oh well it targets this or that right well of course it is and it's hard right but why is it hard because the body's not used to it right and so when you put your body into positions it's not used to it's forced to grow the same thing applies in real life when you learn something new you're gonna suck ass at it at the beginning right that's just a fact of life but as soon as you get used to sucking think about it the more comfortable you get to not being good at something the more you're able to grow right because you let you you let down your defenses and now you're like oh cool all right i know i'm gonna go into this new venture and i'm not gonna know anything right just like when you went into what's the reason why you go to school because you don't know shit and you want to learn something right we all accept that and then you grow and you learn more and you learn more and then after you take that class you knew something that you never knew before hey same thing happens in gym same things happens at work every part of life is that way so stop stop wishing or <clears throat> stop being afraid to fail is really what i'm trying to say so when you when you try new exercises don't be afraid to push it a little harder put a little extra weight on there go a little slower do it a little different right if you're doing the same thing in the gym body's like yo you keep doing the same old bs stuff all right i don't have any reason to change because you're not giving me any reason to change when you start doing something a little different right when you start pushing the pace a little bit you put a little extra weight on you do a different type of exercise now the body has to change to the stimulus that you've created right because now you put the body in a position where it's like oh okay well i have to quickly adapt to something new that you're doing all right so i know this makes sense to you and it resonates with you so don't be afraid to try something new man and you'll be amazed at how your body rewards you with change all right all right i know enough bullshitting with you let me get on to this exercise so this one this is eight pounds so this is a little heavy all right so if you have something like this man cool what you want to do is you want to get a strong foundation right with your feet and you want to whip this damn ball around it's going to be a little bit uncomfortable so you're going to whip it around i'm going to whip it around you're going to be uncomfortable man because what happens is this core has to keep you stable all right this joker is working like freaking crazy man and your shoulder joints too have to be flexible all right so something that you can do is you can warm them up like this all right now this not only warms your shoulder up but it also helps to make it stronger too because this is resistance right it's weight all right so my body is having to fling this thing around and i'll just do the other side real quick and man you know something cool about exercises like this is they're functional and what I mean by that is that your whole body is getting involved, all right? So isolation exercises are real cool. Building up a specific type of strength or for uh, building up the muscle, right? So building up size. Exercises like this, they're not going to give you size. But what they're going to do is they're going to give you a strength that's applicable to real world. All right, so check this out. <laughs> man so 
you feel that like in your hips, you feel that in your core, you feel that a little bit in your shoulders, but man, it's forcing you to be uncomfortable. And you're having to use this. This is the part where you really need to focus, man. Everybody, damn near everybody is weak here, all right? Except professional athletes, they strengthen this, right? And that's what gives them the motor. So if you're involved in a running sport, well, guess what? Those hips are gonna have to be involved and the core, the, the more it can keep you stable, the more you have that turnover speed, all right? Every sport, right? So if you're in the baseball, you gotta turn, right? You gotta have that hip action turn. That's what gives you the strength. Same thing with tennis, golf, everything, all right? So make sure you focus on this. And then you could get on to the other exercise. Then you could get on to the biceps, all right? But if you leave that alone, man, and you're just doing bicep curls, gas is gonna be weak, right? And then you're gonna be more susceptible to injury, all right? So you heard it from your boy, James Lee. Do what's hard and your life will be easy. All right, check this out. Here we do it. Shit might seem crazy but this is the reason why you're willing to do this is because you finally have passion at something all right if you go through life with no passion that leads to depression how could you enjoy life if you're not passionate about something what gets you up every day gets you out of the bed think about it if you had something that you're reaching for every day there was something out there where you're like hell yeah I get to do this today right Think about how much that would change your life. Now you're like, okay, I can get out of bed. I got something good to look forward to. And it's something that's rewarding too. So now you're gonna feel fulfilled, right? You're gonna have a sense of enjoyment. You're gonna be fulfilled and you're really gonna put a lot of effort into it. Think about it. If it's something that you really like, you're, you're gonna work hard as hell to get that done. Versus if you just have to do something, right? You have to go to work, but you don't really like that job. You're not putting in your, you're not giving level 10 effort. You're probably giving level two effort because you're just getting by doing the minimum of what you have to do not to get fired, man. So I encourage you, whatever you're doing in life, find something that you really like to do because your life will change, all right? Now, you're probably sitting there like, man, what the fuck, dude? <clears throat> I'm not lecturing you, but I'm just giving you advice about something that's been able to help me, all right? <clears throat> if you find something that you really passionate about your life will change man all right let's get one more set All right, you guys, you heard it. Go do some hard shit. <laughs> 